In conventional rice farming, paddies are flooded with standing water to prevent weeds from growing. Rice loves the water, and weeds don't. It also keeps the soil soft to help when farmers transplant the young crops. But all that water does something else. It deprives the soil of oxygen. This creates a breeding ground for bacteria. These bacteria are harmless to the rice, but they produce methane gas, which is harmful to our climate. The longer the field is flooded, the more bacteria grow and more emissions are created. We have been working since several years in an alternative methodology called dry seeded rice to grow rice without the use of that much amount of water. Direct seeded rice can be planted directly on the field without having to flood the fields. This has many effects, as for example, it will prevent the emission of methane and it will also support the workers in the farm by making their labor much less intensive. Imagine how much water is needed to grow one kilogram of rice. It's about 3,000 liters. And now imagine you are able to save 30 to 40% of that. And now we don't talk about kilograms, but we talk about tons and tons. So it means that we will be able to save billions of cubic meters of water around the world once we are able to introduce this technology.